45b. Talking about the time. Listen and look. There is one example. Which place did Richard and his class visit this year? Hello, Richard. Did you have a good holiday with the school? Yes, thanks, Aunt Helen. But we didn't go to the mountains this year. Oh, did you go to the beach then? No, we stayed on an island this year. It was excellent. Can you see the tick? Now you listen and tick the box. One. When did Richard's school holiday begin? When did your holiday start, Richard? In the first week of June. Our teacher wanted to go at the end of April, but we couldn't because she was ill. Oh dear! Your uncle and I always go on holiday in September. Do you? Yes. Two. What did Richard do on holiday? We spent one day in a village where people always live in tents. Wow! Did they cook on fires there? Yes, we did that too that day. It was fun. And was the water warm enough to swim in? No, and I wanted to climb the trees and get a coconut, but our teacher said. It's too dangerous. Three. What did Richard bring home? I brought a present home for you. That's kind of you. Let me guess. Is it some sweets? Hmm. <laughs> I know you like those, but no, it's some soap. They make it from one of the plants on the island. I got some for Mum too. Great. Four. When can Richard's aunt watch the holiday film? Our teacher made a film of the holiday. What a good idea! We're going to watch it at ten o'clock tomorrow, and other people in the family can watch it after school at a quarter past four. I think. It's about thirty minutes long. Will you come, Aunt Helen? Yes, I'll come on my bike. Five. What will Richard wear? We aren't going to wear school uniforms when our teacher shows the film. Why not? Because it was too hot to wear jeans on the island, so we all bought some funny shorts. We're going to wear those. Will your teacher let you do that? Oh yes, she's going to wear some too.